Okay guys, so I'm not going to really do any real fancy videos for tech work, but I do want to talk about this specific product here, which is the 13 point or port, is it 13? No, 10. 10 port USB for this. I'll go ahead and zoom in here. So the 10 port USB is basically a product I've been using for uh, quite some time. This basically can hold 10 things for the uh, system. I haven't really talked about this much, but uh, what you can do is you, know, you can simultaneously put you know 10 USB items in here, mainly because the laptop that I have does only takes one uh, port here. I'll go ahead and move this over so you guys can see it. As you can see right there, so that right there is the, the connector. Now this specific laptop does only has one actual USB uh, 3.1 and has two type c cables to put into so this specific thing here expands it to 10 ports so i can actually put 10 uh, tens in 10 things in there so usually i have my mouse that's there Let me zoom out real quick on the mouse the keyboard the the kai mpd 40 is it mp no i'm sorry the apc 40 the version the second version the second generation plus the um the external hard drive that's right here and then so yeah you got the mouse you got the keyboard you got the apc 40 version 2 you got the the solid state drive which i believe that's a terabyte as well as the um that the monitor that's right here and so that's five products plus the uh, i also have the microphone connected to this as well that would, so that would make six i believe this right here uh, i don't know if you guys can see it or not i'll zoom in I'll zoom in a little bit more so you guys can see it. You can see the flashing red light there, or not flash, uh, the red light that's right here, this thing right here, that's also connected as well. It's supposed to be for uh, Cubase, but I haven't used Cubase in a minute. So it has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven items connected to it, but it can, it can hold up to 10, although um, I would not actually recommend it. It would be recommended for the uh, home studio, if anything. Um, I say it because if you're always on the move, you're always going somewhere with a laptop, This I would not recommend that for you. But instead, I actually recommend this here, um, which basically functions the same way, except it does not have the plug to it or an adapter plug to it. So I would, but I would also recommend this as well if you're on the road. But other than that, this would be for the, for the house, unless you, just so happen to find a plug and you have like an extension uh, power strip or whatever but this definitely would work for the time being but the, like i said if you have a home studio i would definitely purchase the thing i'll go ahead and put the an affiliate link into the description so you can find it on amazon which is basically every, everywhere everybody is going now you can't really find it in too many stores which is why i'm going to just go ahead and put a link in amazon but like i said before this this kind of thing um, you can just basically put on to uh, any sort of a uh, laptop that does not have any uh, usb ports definitely worth the purchase i would say i think this is like i believe it's like 40 50 bucks or something like that i have to check the price on that but anyway, it, this is would be this would be a definite addition to the setup that you have, and I would definitely recommend something like this for the for the house if you you know are I don't want to say a couch potato, but you like doing a lot of work at home and yeah. So, but like I said before, if you travel, this is not recommended. I would definitely recommend this instead. But it's two different things that do function the same way. Uh, this is from actually J5Create. You can also find that. I'll put a link in the description for that as well. If you have any other things that you want to uh, want for me to talk about, definitely put it on the channel and then we'll basically go from there. All right, guys, I will see you in the uh, the next video.